Hello, welcome to Math with Niall. Today we'll be adding and subtracting fractions. Hi Niall. Shall we start off with doing one half plus one half? Um, okay, I'll get my half. Uh, okay, so here's a one half. And then here's the other half. And we have one, two halves. Two halves. So it's two halves. And when and you put them together, what happens? When you put them together, it makes a whole. It makes one whole. Let's have a look at what happens when we do one third plus one third. So, we put one third and one third and we have two thirds because we have two of the thirds. We have two of them so they're two thirds. Can we put them together? So if that's two thirds there, what happens if we add one third to two thirds? It becomes three thirds and it is now a whole. Very good, so three thirds is a whole. And how does three thirds look as a fraction if you had to describe it using words? Three over three. Very good. So do you have any idea how many quarters would be equal to one whole? And how would that fraction look? Um, four out of four. Very good. What about tenths? How many tenths will be equal to one whole? Ten. And how would the fraction look? Ten out of ten. Ten tenths, which is equal to one whole. Very good. What is one sixth plus two sixths? So, we have one sixth plus... Okay, and what happens if we add them together? It becomes 3 6. 3 6, very good. So, what did you do with the parts? So, you had 1 out of 6 parts and you were adding it to 2 out of 6 parts. So, what did you do with those numbers? I added them together. What did you add together? 2 and 1. 1 and 2. Good. So you got 3 6. Very good. So what is 3 6? Take away 1 6. Take away 1 6. 2 6. 2 6. So we can take away the numbers as well. So 3 take away 1 equals 2. Yes. So that gives us 2 6. Very good. What is 2 fifths plus 2 fifths? 4 fifths. Oh, do you know it's 4 fifths? Um, because 2 plus 2 equals 4. So can you show us on the board and let's see if you're correct? 2 fifths. Another 2 fifths. And then we have 1, 2, 3, 4 fifths. Can you join them together so we can see what it looks like? We're missing one fifth. We're missing one fifth to do what? To make a whole. Okay, so are you saying that four fifths plus one fifth is equal to a whole? Yes. Okay, if I plus one fifth to it, it's a whole. So how many fifths do we have all together? Five. Five fifths. Very good. Now, Niall, what do you think the answer to two eighths plus four eighths will be? Eight. Can you show us? Two eighths plus four eighths. So what have you done there now? I've I put two eighths and four eighths on our whiteboard. And if you plus them together. It equals six eighths. Can you count them for us? One, two, three, four, five, six. So very good. So adding fractions is very is quite simple when you've got pieces the same size, isn't it? Yes. So what do you think we should do now? Quiz. Are you ready for a quiz? Yes. Okay, brilliant. What can people at home do 
um, you can get a whiteboard and if you have fractions then you could try and get the answers right before I did. What else can they do at home to support us? Um, you can press that subscribe button because we're trying to get to a thousand subscribers. And also don't forget to press that like button. Okay, now, are you ready for this quiz? Of course I am. Okay, first question. What is one fifth plus two fifths? Three fifths. Brilliant. Two eighths plus five eighths? Seven eighths. Good. Three quarters plus one quarter. Four quarters. Which is also? Uh, one whole. One whole, okay. Okay, what is five tenths plus two tenths? Seven tenths. Okay, what is five tenths? Take away two tenths. Three tenths. Okay, what is eight twelfths take away five twelfths? Three twelfths. Okay. What is seven fifteenths take away one fifteenth? Six fifteenths. Correct. What is one whole take away one quarter? Three quarters. What is one whole take away? Three fifths. Three two fifths. <laughs> one whole take away six sevenths. One seventh. Two thirds plus two thirds. W one whole and one third. Very good, Niall. How many thirds is it? Four. Very good. Seven elevenths take away three elevenths. Um, four elevenths. Six thirteenths take away three thirteenths. Three thirteenths. One whole take away four sevenths. Three sevenths. Last question. What is four fifths plus four fifths? Or, or one whole and three fifths. Very good, Maya. Okay. Come on, guys, let's get learning maths together. And if you like our video, press that subscribe button because we're on a quest to get to a thousand subscribers. Please, and don't forget to press the like button. Bye! Bye! Bye. So can you tell me what two-fifths plus two-fifths will be equal to? Ten-fifths. What? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's, you know, in my other video. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs>